Have you been struggling with the question, should I buy a Bose A20 headset with or without Bluetooth installed? Say no more because the answer is that you should buy one without Bluetooth. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can spend less than $20 on an external Bluetooth and add it to your Bose A20 headset right here on Commercial Pilot in Command. All right, I'm super excited about this, so let's get right into it. So, the extra cost to have Bluetooth installed on your Bose A20 is about $100, but you do not need to spend that $100 because you can do it with this. This is a device that I purchased on Amazon for about $16. What is it? It's an external Bluetooth that you can plug into your headset. You connect your phone and you start making phone calls or listening to music instantaneously. Hey, if I've already convinced you that saving the $100 is worth it, I've got a special affiliate link in the description below. It will link you directly to Amazon where you can click on the link, you can purchase this right here and you can add it to your headset. Keep watching the video and I'll show you how you do it. Okay, so here's how this thing works. You get your Bose A20 headset. You Turn it on like you normally would. Then you're gonna take your external Bluetooth and turn it on. That's gonna get it to start to pair. Go over to your phone, then turn on the Bluetooth. Once you get them paired together, you're gonna take your Bluetooth and you're gonna plug it directly into the bottom of the Bose A20 interface. Then once it's connected to your phone, they don't even have to be plugged in. You can just go directly into a phone call or start listening to music without being in the airplane. All right, let's test it out. Let's see how it works. Hey. Hey. Yeah, I'm talking to you on my A20s, my headset. Oh, that's cool. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you great. Okay, bye. All right, bye. One of the things that I think is important is what you have in your flight bag. Having a Bose A20 headset is absolutely necessary. And the reason why is because your hearing is so important as a pilot. The time that you spend in general aviation flying piston airplanes, it's gonna really wear down your hearing over time. Having a headset that protects your hearing for the length of your career is crucial because there's gonna be a day that you get old and I get old and we're not gonna hear ATC talking to us and we're gonna have to ask them to repeat themselves and they're gonna get mad and let's just avoid all that. Get an A20. They have the active noise reduction. Now I know these came out a few years ago, but honestly, these are still the best ones on the market. So take the time, make the investment, get the right headset at the beginning of your career and you will not regret it. Oh, hey, one more thing super important. Make sure you pick up yourself rechargeable batteries. When your A20 headset dies, when you're on short final, it's, it's the worst. It really is. So get yourself rechargeable batteries. These ones right here, these are long lasting. I think uh, they're high capacity. I've had these things last for many, many flights. And the charger's super simple. You just plug them in and you're good to go. Hey, before you go, don't forget to check out the link in the description for the items that I talked about in this video. Make sure you come back and become part of the journey. I'm gonna continue to upload content that I think is gonna be good for you guys in your journey as you build hours. Remember to fly that airplane to the finish every single time.